So just get your, your name and your title, your association with uh, Nest. Yeah, Matthew Thompson. I am the president of Nest Affordable Living Association. So how long have you guys been around? We started officially February of last year, so we're just almost two years old. Now, the release from the municipality says in negotiations for the purchase of the center school or acquisition. Yes. Are you looking to buy it? Yes, yes, okay. that's the goal. The vision is huge. Um, it's not a small task to do what we're doing. There's a lot of working gears and components to it to see it happen. But our goal is to, to get it all to run together, to make it come together and make it a, a viable option for housing for us here. We're not social development housing, we're not low income housing. A lot of people consider us to be a low income housing provider, but we're not because that's the responsibility of the provincial government in itself. We are geared specifically towards what is considered the low to moderate income earner. It's the most unserved area here on the South Shore. And we know of hundreds who are right now struggling uh, to either pay their rent or even to find a place to live at the moment. So we're geared specifically towards that income bracket. We're in the early negotiation stages uh, for this facility, uh, but affordable housing, who can speak against it? We know we need it. We will explore all options throughout our municipality uh, for affordable housing and our doors are open for affordable housing. The building in itself is salvageable, um, but we are gonna be completely gutting it. It's gotta be remediated for asbestos and mold first professionally, and then we're gonna be taking it down to the superstructure and then building from there. And in doing so, it gives us this, this ability to get it done quicker, but to be able to provide the housing at a faster rate and in doing so, it just allows us to be able to, you know, put together all the cogs and make it work. So we have been in the capital campaign for a while. We have some very generous donors um, and we have a sizable amount already set aside for this from donations this year. We are working with the CMHC through the Federal Affordable Housing Fund that's available for projects just like this. So we're in that process going through it. And we're talking to other independent agencies as well as the provincial government and the federal government to help kick in with this as well.